Welcome back to Sportsline, the final three minutes of the show. I'm Steve Wrigley sitting in for Steve Lehman and John Burton, two guys who had quite a run going through the Predator Stanley Cup season. And man, then it was the draft. No, I'm sorry, it was the draft first, then the Stanley Cup playoffs, and then uh, training camp. So those guys are taking a couple days off. They'll be back soon. I'm just filling in. I'm just a substitute for another guy. Uh, let's take a look at the rest of the preseason here for the Tennessee Titans. We've got the Carolina Panthers in town. A two o'clock kick on Saturday over at LP Field. Man, you better better hydrate before you head out for that one and be careful with the adult beverages because it is going to be steaming hot. And hopefully you'll get to see a little bit of offense that didn't really show up in the opener against the Jets, but you won't see much Cam Newton because uh, he's uh, he's kind of banged up, so he's not going to be playing. And then they, they go to the Bears in a noon kickoff. I'm sorry, then they have the Bears here the following week, a noon kickoff, and then it's at the Chiefs to wrap up the uh, the preseason, August 31st, and then they uh, open up the season. Yeah, there's the Chiefs game. And then it all gets started with the Oakland Raiders right here in Nashville. This will be the big game for, uh, for the NFL on CBS. 11 of the 16 games for the Titans are right here on CBS on News Channel 5, and they've got the, uh, the number one announcing crew will be covering this game because a lot of people think the Raiders are a Super Bowl contender. Now, they've added Marshawn Lynch in the offseason, and uh, he, he, uh, he knelt for the, uh, or he sat for the national anthem last week. So that's created a lot of uh, off the field stuff that Jack Del Rio probably didn't want to have you know, leading into the season. But hey, man, everybody's got a right to express themselves the way they want to express themselves. That's what made this country great. I appreciate you guys letting me express myself the way I have the last uh, hour. But I want to tell you, too, that after week one, they go to Jacksonville and play a noon game on CBS. That's a league game. And one of the keys to the Titans this year is to get in the playoffs, they're going to have to win the division, or they should win the division. And last year, they were terrible in the division. I believe they went two and four. So getting off to a good start against the Jaguars will be important. And then the next week, the Seahawks come to town. So really, if you're a Titans fan and you're kind of on the fence about going to a game, you've got two of the best two of the best teams in the NFL coming to Nashville in the first two home games of the season. So it's, uh, it's going be, gonna to be a great year to watch. Gonna, got to see if Marcus Mariota can resume that, that form and... Uh, if the Titans can do their thing. Hey, it's been a lot of fun sitting in for Steve and John. I'm Steve Wrigley. See you tonight on News Channel 5 at 10. Good night.